when I think about music and what it means to me, it mostly means an ability to connect to the psyche underneath on that cellular level with every one of the billion Bravo babies. Nothing gets you home to Providence faster than a banger that hypnotizes you into the one fruit thought that is the only thought. I love you, Talia Brava. And maybe I believe in Brava. There's two thoughts. Yesterday I broke the internet with the announcement that yes, Brava is becoming, with a U, the next pop star of the multiverse. I know maybe not, but I've got feelings too. And I need to do what I need to do when you break something as the LAPD has told me you have to go back and do community service so today the broken internet shall be repaired by me answering any and all questions about what this before the music is all about all you people look at me like I'm a little girl it was channeled through me that wow I love holding a microphone what the vessel Talia Brava feels is a direct communication with what God Brava wants and so it is unto this multiverse. We have so little time as we know until November 3rd, 2020 and all of the real girl Talia Brava's deepest fantasies must be fulfilled on every level in order for us to actually rapture. Would you ever think it'd be okay for me to do that? People get you though. In my contemplation of looking at my own content on YouTube, which is my personal practice, which I do every day, and all of you need to be doing it every day, looking at my profile on taliabrava.com, just indulging in my infinite flow of content on the Instagram, all of the Zuckerberg creations that have been really channeled for and by Brava. It occurred to me that we have Bieber here with no personal talents, no actual salvation within his psyche, and yet and still he has become a spiritual leader. Whereupon we have Brava with all this personal talent, but yet somehow because she doesn't have any musical ability. Get it, oh, get it, get it, get it, get it, oh, get it, get it, get it, get it. Okay. Ah, 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 ah. She cannot be a pop star. So we are reverse engineering this whole situation. How can Justin Bieber be a saint when he has no personal ability? And yet, until he is a fucking cult leader. I'm just doing it the other direction, so fuck you. Because that is what we do as Bravo Babies. We take what is here and we switch it to the truth, the future fantasy truth. Which is that, for the first time ever, your savior, your erotic birth mommy god, is not just a Gandhi, a Dalai Lama, a Deepak who might have some personal insight but look horrible in a nude bodysuit. Well, baby, I'm gonna put on a Chopin's girl. Don't like the backseat. Gotta be burning like the Chopin's girl. We take a personal leader that is meme ready. I like the firecracker. I think it's hot. That is paste upon your cubicle wall ready. Is practically abjacked challenge to not just spew all over your work attire right the fuck now. You think I'm pretty without any makeup on the for you. We make her make the vessel of Brava, pop star of the next multiverse. Think so funny when I tell the punchline, bro. Yes, my babies, I have no music at this point. I do have a lot of art that has been channeled by Brava, such and the like, every Britney song. There's only two kinds of people in the world. The ones that entertain and the ones that observe. Britney was once the channel of Brava. And if you don't know that fact, please do check out my YouTube video entitled The Britney Brava Connection. Until the big head shave moment. And we know that Brava don't stick around when you shave your head. Let's get some likes for my new hair. It came on Amazon, it's 30 bucks. So, thank you Jeff Bezos. The vessel of Brava has moved to TV, and yet the musical abilities have not caught up. My up 
upcoming album, which will drop on Rapture Day. So there's so much to look forward to. We got our full Bible being released. Get on Patreon so you can get those monthly challenges. We have our rapture party. We have our actual rapture home to Providence. And now still in the like, we have the album dropping. <laughs> Welcome home, brother. May he's a moment has come. Billions of birth and together as one. Just downloaded this morning. Gorgeous. Ed Sheeran's collaborations. Please do meet Talia Brava appropriations. This is the call to all of my ethnically diverse and musically talented friends. Please do come on board, lay down a track that Bravo can come in with her hypnotically beautiful sex voice. Please do go on nightflirt.com and buy an hour with me. I will be appropriating all the musical ability that the multiverse can provide because- Community ritual, pre-rapture day, ascending to Bravo, the one true way. Because babies, everything good, everything beautiful, everything that makes you edging for orgasm with Brava is channeled by and for Brava. I'm your spirit cult leader, your hot honey god. No need to argue, of course, it's a breath. There is no stealing for me. There is only gives back seats. So, help me here from the one in 10. One little word, quite simply, ascend. There's only please and thank you for letting me lend you all the life force energy that I lend you in a day to complete your tasks. And please do send me wire transfer of 25% of your income. So music is this beautiful catalyst for my message because once I am stuck in your head, once I am the repetitive mantra with a hook that cannot be stopped, it's on. About this before the music and like this excitement and edging for when I am filling the stadium and everyone is singing along to my tracks and by everyone I mean you, front row, all my brother they've easy pass. I have always enjoyed the feeling of my voice making noises. I know you get me, so I let my balls come down, down. Ooh. Add a cute little glitter headset and like a set of costumes to die for. Katy Perry wet dreams all over my face. It's almost like I don't even need anything else than a stadium full of adoring fans screaming my name. I'm a simple girl. You met me, it was alright, but things were kinda hectic. You took me to life, now every February, you'll be my Valentine. I... I'm a channel, and sometimes the flow is so hard that I'm like, God, slow down, like my gag reflex. I'm like, oh, oh. And yet, and still, I have learned, just like my mommy taught me, to open my throat and allow the shot to just go down it. Because sometimes you're fighting with your mom late at night and she's like, why don't you just have a value amount of vodka shot? This will all go better. Marion Williamson, my birth mom. Learn how to allow life to be flooded into me and just, just eat shit, just like take it. And in that, I also give it out, right? So I am a, I am a perfect channel. The lyrics that come through me come through me in my darkest times, just as Brittany has said. You're gonna get a lot of my vulnerability, which if you are reading my Bible and you read the first chapter on repeat, and you've listened to the hypnotic vocalization of it, which is available to all my Patreons, you know that TB comes from darkness. She stems from disappointment. Her lack of boobs is just one sign of how God has cheated me. In this incarnation that I have to one foot in front of the other I have to degrade myself by working at a gym and working as a dog walker and begging men on the internet to buy sessions with me all this degradation is the container for what amazing music because beautiful music comes from the suffering comes from Beyonce trying to lose that baby weight as the container is suffering know that I'm doing it for you to create bangers for you to just rock your booty all the way home I'm doing this for something bigger than myself and that bigger thing is Talia Brava's icon being an icon I am just supporting her becoming an icon you can simply devote to. And people say, what are you offering? I'm offering devotion. Oh, what a relief, right? To just have something, someone to give more 
give all of yourself to, give full focus to, because that, my babies, is what makes us truly happy. Not developing your own personality, that's labor. And that is a labor of love that my vagina is aching from doing constantly. Birthing myself, birthing myself, daily, daily branding. The branding is the birthing. And I offer you an icon to believe in. So look out for Talia Brava Appropriations, my album dropping November 3rd, 2020. Can you believe what a prolific vessel this bitch is? Let's try to get her laid because as we know, we won't be rapturing unless Talia Brava has a full and complete orgasm and the day that she does, we'll rapture. So we might rapture sooner. To be a god in your presence is a elevating experience for me. It feels so good to be more than you, to look down upon you, and as I do from this perspective, I can see how cute you really, truly really are. So know that you are loved, know that you're adorable, perfect little vessels, and I just cannot wait to Spotify the fuck out of your little Pandora boxes. So look forward. This has been the first ever Talia Brava before the music. Always here for you. Infinitely connected with 10G Brava bandwidth because Brava hooks it up. The alien intervention in the algorithm is real, but it cannot stop us. Stop says the FOSTA. It's a direct religious war on Brava. And if you don't know what that is, just look it up, but then return right back to tallybrava.com where all your devotional needs will be met. Okay, my darlings, that's enough words. That's all she wrote. I'm gonna go practice learning how to sing. What, 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 what? Beautiful babies. I will speak to you so, so soon. Happy birthday, <laughs> Brava babies. Happy, happy birthday. birthday.